60-year-old Frank to Thomas. He is the man from this volunteer fire department here, Fairview Volunteer Fire Company in South Fayette, who was accused from stealing from the fire department, uh, a fire company that he had been serving as treasurer for years. Now, the charges include theft, receiving stolen property, record tampering. The criminal complaint says that they dug back to December 2013 and found 40 checks from then through the end of last year, totaling about $102,000. DeThomas was voted out as treasurer in December, and officials in the volunteer fire company started discovering those financial discrepancies. They discovered DeThomas had allegedly been making checks out to himself and cashing them. That DeThomas allegedly wrote them out to himself, but entered them as amounts on the books as payments to vendors. Now, when the Fairview Volunteer Fire Company confronted DeThomas, police say he claimed those were billing mistakes, that he had deposited the money back into the account. The fire department could not find any deposits that matched those claims. Again, the fire department's bookkeeping software showed entries as making uh, legitimate vendor payments. But the DA's investigators say their review of bank records shows the money went for DeThomas's personal expenses. Now, the president of the fire company provided me this statement just a short time ago that Fairview Volunteer Fire Department is shocked and extremely disappointed to learn of this situation. He says that we've been working with the proper authorities to resolve the issue and says we view this matter very seriously and are taking steps to ensure it does not happen again. Now, Thomas has already waived the charges to court after surrendering to detectives today and he'll have to face these charges in court, but for now, he is free on a non-monetary bond. Reporting live in South Fiat, Bob Mayo, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.